Hi everyone, I'm the CEO and one of the co-founders of uh, Smart Token Labs. My name is Victor. <coughs> Sorry, Smart Token Labs is the uh, holding company for two key projects in Web3 space, <coughs> the token script and also uh, Alpha Wallet. <coughs> so we believe in uh, Web3 and we understand to have mass adoption privacy, self-custodial ownership, and speculation won't be the key drives, but user experience is. Uh, where is the same key drive move Web 1 to Web 2? So Web 3 need to provide 100 times better user experience than Web 2. And to have this uh, uh, much better user experience, the key building block should be token instead of that. Because as that are still using the same application century framework, where the maximum user experience you can imagine it, it can get will still be the same as Web2. And with um, uh, composability, intercompatibility still happen at the application layer, the same old issue will always be there. Sooner or later, there will be centralized integration platforms to integrate all those uh, different uh, decentralized dApps to provide better user experience because that's what, uh, what users want. And those centralized integration platform will grow bigger and bigger and become the new gatekeepers, exactly the same as what we have in Web2. So we think the right way to build Web3 is using a token-centric framework, user-centric framework. Use token as the object instead of the application and let composability, interoperability happen at the token layer. And let services integration happens in users' own user agent. Like, the, uh, like their wallet or their browsers instead of uh, happening on the big platforms. So you will have um, uh, tokens representing what you have, who you are, what you have done, all in your wallet. And the different services, different applications are fully integrated with each other in your wallet via those tokens. And you will have your own fully integrated web right in your hand, which will be able to deliver 100 times better user experience than existing Web2. So again, only this will, we believe only this will drive the real mass adoption of Web3, not privacy, not self-custody ownership, not speculation. So for us to make this vision really happen, we build a token century framework, token script, and also a super user agent, Alpha Wallet. And um, I will briefly explain the, pro the two projects since we only have a very limited time. So token script. So token script gave uh, each token a program interface on top of the blockchain smart contract, and which makes the token smart. By saying smart, that means uh, with more uh, utilities built into the token interface and also make the token uh, fully portable and composable, enables the token to be the Web3 building block and turns the, all the tokens into an uh, open API controlled and owned by user. And for, <clears throat> and for Alpha Wallet, uh, internally we call it as a contact-based integration platform in user's hand, where all the services integrated in the wallet via tokens. For easy understanding, you can think in Alpha Wallet as a decentralized version of WeChat platform or Alipay platform. And for the past four years, we are um, we've been in the market for over four years, not like uh, uh, some new projects. We have been using token script and uh, Alpha Wallet to deliver more than thirty different tokenization projects with different business partners. And currently, Alpha Wallet is the largest EVM open source mobile wallet in terms of uh, how many other people or other business is using our code base. We have over 400 folks um, just on GitHub. And <clears throat> I, um, I may explain uh, one example. So uh, this is the first NFT project we did back in 2018, where we partner with the FIFA exclusive ticket agent to a data experiment to tokenize 50 FIFA World Cup tickets on Ethereum. So those are NFTs, but much more than a picture, which um, because it's um, with token script, smart token interface, 
uh, user's wallet can interact with the gate directly and also third-party services can be integrated right into user's wallet to provide the super user experience like the hotel booking without manually inputting location and date because the token with the smart token interface brings the full context. And there are many other uh, projects we did in the before. In before, and if you are interested, you can uh, visit our uh, websites. We are quite lucky to have uh, some uh, reputable investors backing us since the very beginning, which of course, including Long Hash uh, and Hash Key, Fenbu uh, Crypto.com, Framework, Mechanism, Huobi, OKEX, and also uh, some uh, uh, individuals like uh, Mark Cuban, who are very excited about uh, what we are building. And currently we have uh, 31 people globally, including three co-founders, myself, our CTO, and also our chief engineer. I consider we have the best tech team in the Web3 space. Uh, just give you one example, our CTO, who is also the designer of Token Script, he started contribute to uh, Bitcoin code since uh, 2011, forked the Bitcoin three times doing all coin for different business, and also date seven architect work uh, for different e uh, Ethereum based ICO project. And then he joined the uh, largest bank in Australia be, uh, before start the Smart Token Labs. At the bank, he served as the blockchain architect and also is one of the global architects for R3 Coda, where he lead more than 20 different uh, blockchain, uh, bank-related blockchain applications. And in this year, we start, um, we start seeing uh, people can really start to understand why we need a token centric framework. For example, like uh, Chris Dixon uh, always uh, been, been start, start talking about the token should be the primitive, token should be the object, token will be the new web. And that is uh, why we decide in this year, we need to move faster. And this is the key reason why um, we want to do another round of uh, equity fund raising. And the fund will be mainly used for recruit more engineer and also to properly form a, a growth team. And we are interested in bringing in two to three new resourceful investors. And if you want to join the uh, adventure, you can contact me. So this is my Twitter and also my email address. Thank you very much for watching. Cheers.